it sank deep in the soft snow. The moonlight made big shadows. Annie did not like them, but she wanted to find Bo. She saw a scary shape. It was coming right toward her. There was no place to hide. That was, oh, Annie stopped the scary shape. Stop! Annie, it said, Annie knew that voice. She said, why are you such a scary shape? <clears throat> because I have a su the surprise on my head, said Bo. Oh, Bo, said Annie, that is very big surprise. She threw her arms around him. Off, said Bo. The surprise flew off his, his head. Chapter 8. Bo and Annie start, 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 stared at the surprise. What is it? asked Annie. It was a full moon cake, said Bo. It was big and round and golden. It was just like the moon. Now look, it's a big mess. Ah! <laughs> <laughs> Both felt awful. He threw himself down in the snow. See, Mama, that's small. Mama, that's small. He okay. felt worse. Wait, Bo, said Annie. I have an idea. Stay right there. Annie ran off. She came back with two forks. It used to be a full moon cake, she said. Now it is a snowy moon cake. She handed Bo and a fork. We better eat fast, she said, or it will be a frozen moon cake. Soon the cake was all gone. Chapter 9. They went back to Annie's house. Now I will you make you a surprise, she said. Bo waited downstairs. He was freezing cold. He had snow in his pants. <laughs> he had snowy moon cake in his tummy. I don't see any surprise, said Bo. It's too big to carry, said Annie. Come with me. Bo followed Annie upstairs. Surprise, said Annie. A big hot bath just for you. Yes, said Bo. He and he jumped right in. Done. <laughs>